we're trying to maintain the uh, uh, the 2.8 percent increase that we have uh, that's scheduled uh, right now for October 1. Um, we're hoping to maintain that, which will hopefully help a lot of the companies out there that are really struggling. Um, we want, you know, we're, we're always looking at, at different ways we can address tort, things of that nature. Those are usually a state-by-state -state issue and not so much a federal issue. Um, so different, uh, when you meet with different congressmen or senators you're, or their staffs, you're trying to discuss it so they're aware of it. And, you know, when it becomes an issue in the state, you want their support, which is usually very important. Um, we have a, you know, a, a list of items that we're, you know, we're having workforce issues right now um, across the board everywhere. So obviously we have to be careful, but, but you know, uh, immigration is a hot topic right now. So we're going to look to try and see if we can't find some new and creative ways to get some more staff for us. And the problem is, is, you know, if you have a McDonald's down the street or a Chick-fil-A that's paying 15 or $17 an hour, minimum wage to, you know, flip burgers or cook fried chicken, um, you're not going to want to come and work at a skilled nursing facility because the, the job is a lot harder. Um, now it's more fulfilling at the end of the day and the people who like that work are going to do it. So it's, it's you know, we since, you know, 70% of our population, probably close to 80% total, is funded through the state and federal government between Medicaid and Medicare. So at the end of the day, that's that's our our primary focus is to maintain our funding, try not to get Medicaid cuts, trying to ensure that the legislators understand um, that we're taking care of their grandmothers, in some cases mothers and fathers, in some cases themselves, to be quite blunt about it. With hip knee replacements, shoulder replacements being done now, um, they're coming in and we're taking care of them and getting them back home.